All right, everybody, let's get set, set up for our WordPress blog establishment. First thing you want to do is go to your MyCI login, log in, go ahead and log in. And then once you're in, go to your, to go to the CI keys option. Now, if you've not um, established your, if you've never used CI keys before in a previous class, whatever, you want to hit get started. Now, I've already gotten started. So uh, the very first time you're gonna go in and you're going to just set it up. And, and after you go through that one dialog box, you will never have to return to that dialog box. Um, in my case, I've already done that. Key thing is when you, when you type that in, they're gonna ask for, when you first establish this, it's gonna ask for your uh, desired web address. So it's gonna be, okay, it's gonna look something like this. So in this case, uh, Eddie decided to name his site just Eddie. And so it, that that name that he typed in um, popped in here. And then the actual address is that name dot .com. So whatever you're going to pick, this is going to be your initial address. Now you can change this. You can change the um, the way it presents to the world. We'll talk about that, about that later. In my case, mine's called Pirate Lab. You could um, name it whatever you want. So the only key requirement is that you have a professional um, name. If you wanted to have your first name, that's fine. Your last name, that's fine. But don't want to be something like uh, uh, Purple Kitty 14 or something like that, right? You want it to be something that speaks to your professionalism, something that you'll be willing to share with potential future employers, etc. So once you've established that, um, we'll come back and we'll talk about how we will um, get that very first website up and running.